Hello, this is Broyer, and welcome back to another episode of our Let's Play for Civilization VI, continuing our deity run with Vietnam. And uh, so far, okay. We do have, what, one, two, three, four, five, six cities? So that's a good number. Uh, the reason that's a good number, at least partially, is because luxuries do affect six cities, so that will help us a bit. Yeah, I don't know. We'll see. I definitely want to get a couple more out, but maybe not. It doesn't have to be super urgent. Mostly because we, um, I mean, we, we as long as we're getting faith, like that's all we need. We just got to get faith to get the, the, the uh, apostles out. Doesn't really matter how big our empire is otherwise. I've got a settler out here. Right, get some research going somewhere. Yeah, we're going to get the iron mine soon. I know we're only saving one turn, but one turn is, you know, a turn. Build an aqueduct probably will happen at some point. Let's see if we can get that rolling and see if we can get the iron mine up by then. Uh, Mosque, we can go ahead and grab you. Uh, any other faith buys? I mean, obviously, I know we can get some apostles, and we probably should start getting the apostles out and about. I was wanting to get our main guy set up first, though. Um, sorry, our main, uh, who is it? Him. Moksha. So that we can uh, get that extra spread there as well. And potentially, if we get Mont St. Michel, you know, wouldn't be bad either. Yeah, honestly... Holding on to building up our faith to get all those done would give us some really good apostles. I think I think that's the plan. All right, so temple's done here. Chichen Itza. I mean, it's not bad. It's not. It's not like it's going to be useful for that city necessarily. Religious tourism, Saint Basil's. Maybe. Preserve plus three out there actually. Harbor. Probably a good idea. Probably the best idea. Give us a little bit of culture bomb. We'll get the pearls in our territory at the very least, even though they're not actually workable. But yeah, it is what it is. Um, okay. Uh, oh, we need to get another builder, which we can do that after maybe the city's done. We can probably buy the builder, actually. You know what? We will. Not going to cost us that much, and we might as well. Oh, he's going to put a settler way up here, probably. Not within range of our um, pressure, most likely. You seem to be fully under control, so it doesn't look like we're going to be flipping any other cities, unfortunately. Mostly because he got Augsburg in there. If he didn't have Augsburg, I would be flipping Bra Bremen right now, I believe. All right, let's grab this thing. See what it does. We're all apprentices in a okay, it finished off apprenticeship. That's unfortunate, but we have several that are partially complete, so it's not like we could have... I, it wasn't worth waiting until we got one that wasn't or something like that. It, it was obviously very random, so here's what it is. A couple science, a couple food, and we're about to get some faith from it as well, so not, not terrible. We might even put this guy's holy site over here. Uh, give him some of the land over here and uh, give it a little bit more faith that way as well. Yeah, you're just going to put it up there, aren't you? Oh, there goes our scout. Oh, well. Okay, so holy site is done. We do need you to get it. Oh, no, you're going to get the one that's going to get the uh, the galley. Uh, I mean, I think at this point we just go straight into the shrine. You, can you buy a galley? Yeah, let's just get a galley out. Get that done. Uh, trader here. Uh, 
I mean, at this point, um, there's not any city states. There's not. Probably just, I don't know, get some generally good stats or religious pressure. Send it to Hamburg. Get a little bit of faith coming back. Some science. Uh, we could send it to Granada. Start sending some of our religion that way. Although we start getting some of their religion coming back. Three science from Montreal. That's pretty good. It's 10% increase in science. I think we go that route. Or I could have sent it here to this city and uh, given its production, but that's okay. Um, apparently we could put another one over there. Oh, wow. I guess it makes sense. I just wasn't thinking about it. Yeah, why not? Um, who's starving? Nobody? Okay, remind me to look at that next, because I think it just keeps fluctuating. I don't think they're actually starving, but they're sort of starving. You can get plus two faith for this? Oh, no, you've already got plus a faith there. That's why. Okay. I mean, sure. It's kind of... Yeah. I, I don't know. I just... I wasn't actually expecting these to be halfway decent. They actually are kind of halfway decent. There's a possibility we could build more at some point, too. I mean, I'm not going to complain about some science, for sure. I don't think we're changing anything at the moment. I mean, we get some gold from Merchant Confederation, which is not bad. But, you know, more influence points. Also not bad. We'll just leave it as is for now. I mean, that gives us an envoy. And Harbor Agency could be handy at some point. Not super critical. Uh, we could get some more land units, though. We need eight. We got one, two, three, four, five, six. So, yeah, just a couple more land units would not be too impossibly hard to get. I guess come hook up the deer at this point. All right, let's switch you over to iron working to finish that off. Turns on this, which actually would give us some warrior monks, which would give us some land units. Jebel Park Isle is not bad. Uh, actually, Jebel Park Isle is really good. But I don't think we have... Well, we do if we build this city down here. A desert hill. One desert hill. But we have to get a settler to do that. All right, we do own three archers. This will open up our void chins, which are pretty awesome. Or so I'm told. Um, let's see here. Seven turns on our warrior monks. Hopefully we can get this. Four turns, one turn, two turns. Okay, looking okay. Lighthouse is done. Um... I want to get a trader out just to get some more production for this city. Remember that people break down too, not just machinery. Castles gives us coursers. Uh, Stirrups gives us the knight, and we can go take that. Send somebody up to this thing. In fact, we can go ahead and send you up there to be ready right now. Um, are we on the clock for ERA? We are on the clock. 
Maybe we want a Dark Age. Don't know that we do. Hmm. Don't really want another Normal Age, though, to be honest. Sounds kind of boring. Uh, getting used to production would be really useful. 780 to buy it. It's probably the best way for you to get it. Because everything else is just going to be super slow. Let's start working on the granary. And hope that we can buy that here in a bit, if I remember. Way up there. There's actually quite a bit of land up here that could be useful for us. It's, it's very spread out. Um, but it's a possibility. Uh, we're not going to be killing unit with a quadrant. Let's just finish that one off. There's there's the potential we might use something there. It's I don't know. We do have a lot of harbors, and they could give us some good gold. Three turns on our Kotoku Inn, which is going to be really nice if we can get it done. No. Okay, Colossus. Shrine's done. Honestly, going right into the temple. Um, oh, you can be a Void Chain right now. Although I'm saving my gold. But we got three turns. Okay, yes, chill. I was like, I know there's a reason I'm sitting you up here. It's for the night. 12 turns on that. Getting there. All right, I don't think we're changing anything, even though this would give us, oh, five, yeah. Still not, not amazing, amazing. Um, I guess we're gonna leave Gothic architecture in there for now. Do we still want veterancy? Don't really have a specific reason for anything else at the moment, so I guess so. Um, seven turns. Start working on humanism. I don't know that we're going to get a great artist. I'm not sure if it helps our long-term goals. Hey, Cardiff. For every harbor building. Oh, okay. It's not a bad one. Plus, just getting one point in there would be nice. About to get a harbor. About to get our wonder. Warrior Monk's probably going to be our strongest unit. Very cool. All right. Nice. That gives us marks because of the units. What are your monks? They are, in fact, our strongest units <laughs> by far. Um, too bad we don't have the extra promotion stuff for them, but it's okay. I guess we'll spread you guys out a bit. Uh, where I want to send you. Just whatever. Stay there. Stay nearby. That bumps up our military strength quite a bit right away. We have a couple spots for aqueducts potentially. I also build that, especially if we get rid of the sheep on one of those hills. It's not a. Oh, we don't have any tundra. But that's okay. We'd get the religious tourism at least. Although we don't need tourism, so never mind. I, I'm, I'm actually going to ignore that one. Don't really need it. Tempted to pop the sheep here. Um, just so we can preserve the forest here. I think that's going to be the plan. Let's get a builder out. I 
I mean, this one's not super critical, but just getting another ally is almost always good. Honestly, though, we're not going to be able to get anything from it. So we'll just sit on it, that last one. One more turn on stirrups, and then we'll move you over. Uh, we still can't buy this right. Seven something, wasn't it? 780. Well, one wonder down, another one to go, and then hopefully another one shortly after that as well. All right, there's our knight, potentially. Yep, there's our knight. Well, we have a okay military at the moment now. <laughs> we just got a pretty big bump to it, at least. Um... Yeah, okay. That's a really good wonder, obviously. No, our line's expired. Need more housing. We'll check the deals in a moment. Will you be my friend? Um... Do you have religion, Germany? Unmet, unmet, Germany. Okay, yeah. Both Germany and Canada. So both our neighbors do have religions. So we don't really want a religious thing if we can help it. Granary, we need, we need lots of things here. Let's get the granary. We're going to need housing. Um, let's, okay, I was going to go back to you and get some sort of alliance. Probably just an economic one for now. Do we want to make a void chin? And I don't know. I don't think we're going to get a golden age either way. So I think we just want to sit on it. We'll check it. We'll reevaluate re -evaluate here in a moment. All right, trader, we need to go for whatever's the best production because the city needs some production. Although, getting a little bit of gold coming back as well is always good. So I guess Berlin is the move. One less production, but gives us gold. And other things. All right, knights. Have you always been able to automate exploration with non-scouting units have i not noticed that before okay well we're gonna try that you are gonna come back down here my friend this can go away Stupid barbarian. All right, we're coming. We're coming for you, my friend. Now there's another one. No, what are you doing, dummy? Dummy, stop it. Why are you got to be dumb? Oh my goodness, go away, barbarian. Our builder is done. This builder was going to get rid of the sheep, I believe, was the plan. Uh, I guess temporarily we can build. Doesn't really matter. Just a barracks or something. And of course he goes away after he does all his damage.
just here to harass us. Now at least he came back to try and get my... Wait, you can go in the ocean? Why can't you go in the ocean and I can't? Galley's... I didn't, what? I'm confused. Um, uh, establish an embassy, I guess. Oh, I need to check my money. Probably should have waited on them that, but that's okay. Oh, we got enough. I should have bought this already. Oh, stupid barbarians. Granary is done. Okay, so now we actually have some production coming in. We can actually build something. Still kind of want the harbor, like right here. To hopefully maybe build a canal here at some point. How much... <laughs> How much production are we actually getting here? Because it's confused. It's kind of funny. Obviously, the holy site at some point would be critical. Let's get the harbor out. I mean, more more trade routes are always good. Well, we'll get we will get the holy site though. That is definitely going to happen. Um, I guess we can hook up the deer. I don't think there's any reason to sit on that. Oh, I was going to check this. Yeah, I mean, we wouldn't be able to get to 79 by getting the Void Chin. So we'll, so we'll sit on our Void Chins. Well, we'll just we'll wait till the next era or something like that. Go away. Probably one of these two. We got five trade routes, about to get a six most likely soon. Let's do that one. We're probably gonna, I mean, we'll be okay, I think. I, I think it's gonna be about the same. I don't know that how much which one would be better. Uh, we're actually a little bit low on housing here. A preserve at some point would be useful. Potentially. Put it up there, put it over here. It's, there's neither one of these is great. As far as adjacencies and stuff. Let's try it over here. Uh, yeah, actually, that's not a terrible place to put the mausoleum. I was planning on building it over here, though. Do you... Oh, yours is damaged, though. Um, let me get that repaired, and we're going to check and see what which one looks better. Apparently you could do an aqueduct. If we put it in any of these other places, we get plus two culture. But this is not one that goes on a... Um, Sorry, what I'm trying to say. This one does not go on a uh, jungle. It would get rid of the jungle or rainforest or whatever. So, honestly, over here, it's fine. Even though we do lose the two cultures, then what's the benefit of getting this? Not really any. So, we're just going to sit on that for now. I honestly don't know what's the best thing here. I mean, maybe a round of Holy Star prayers just to get some more faith coming. We got a lot of faith, and we do want to build some things. I'm waiting for Mount St. Michel, and I'm also waiting for his next promotion. I'm hoping the combination gets us what we want. You know what? Another builder. You can never have too many builders. I mean, I guess you technically can, but it's kind of hard to have too many builders. Oh, that's for both of them. I was like, how in the world are you giving me so much money? That is for both. So you want coffee for 300 gold. 
Sure. And then you'll still give me 10 gold for that. That's fine. Uh, yeah, and I will take some salt. All right, we're going to go ahead and put a cut in there. When we come back, hopefully we finish the Mont Saint-Michel and go from there. But I do appreciate you guys watching. May God bless you, and I hope you join me again next time. Thank you, and goodbye. I wanted to give a special shout-out to the following channel members. Thank you so much for supporting the channel.